the backyard to put new strings in my old guitar. The E was flat, the A it stayed sharp. I had no idea at all how happy it would make small. And how drunk you and I'd get before dark. Hi guys, so even though right now we're actually not vlogging today, I feel obligated Mommy. to just get this in to the beginning of whatever video and let you all know that I am having some major mom guilt right now. I bought these like right when the Valentine's Day Target uh, dollar spot stuff went out. I knew, I had it in my head, I knew that we had to do the Valentine's Day cards and we had to bring them today to school because he would be handing them out in his class. I forgot, I literally forgot. I wanted to cry and I know it sounds silly, it's just Valentine's Day cards. All I could do was picture my poor child just sitting there with no Valentine's Day cards to hand out and everyone else was enjoying handing them out to people. And I really love the idea of teaching Cooper to give. So for me, I more so care that he didn't have any to give. So it just like really upset me and I felt basically like a poop parent. Felt like poop of a parent, really crummy. So Cooper came home, he had all of these Valentines. Dan spoke to the teacher and she said that Cooper can come in with Valentines next week when he comes back to school. So, Whatever, I am trying to just make the best of the situation. I'm sitting here with Cooper, he's drawing on them, I'm putting them together and we'll just hand them in late and that's that. Mommy. But yeah, I felt really crummy because honestly, I understand it's really not that big of a deal. Don't do it. But it is to me because I really wanted him to Mommy, experience. I'll make, I'm gonna do it. Sure, I really wanted him to like experience his first Valentine's Day in, you can do it, you need rope in class and like here I am just like messing that up for him. I don't know. Mom guilt, I'm telling you. It's really at the end of the day, it's not a big deal, but sometimes these things feel like a big deal. Yeah, good job. Okay, next one. Can you reach it? Here, look, look up. Can you get that? Pull it. Wow, good job. Did you just fart on me? <laughs> mm. <laughs> you did fart on me, it's stinky. But yeah, so this is what they look like. These are from the Target dollar spot. But anyway, I'm gonna go, and the reason I wanted to share this with you is because if you think I have it all together all the time, I do not. If you think that I never have mom guilt, you are very much so wrong. And if you think that I don't sweat the small stuff, I am human, and sometimes I sweat the small stuff. So yeah, I forget things, and I feel like drunk sometimes. But at the end of the day, what are we thankful for? Mommy and Daddy and Cooper and Will are healthy, right? And happy. And me too. Yeah, and we have a nice house that keeps us warm. Mm, I think Will's awake. Will is awake. Will's not awake yet. You want Will to be awake so we can do bubbles. And we have bubbles. And we have money to buy Valentine's Day cards. You That's know, nice. Maybe next year what we can do is we can buy one set for us and we can buy two sets and we can donate it. I think that's a good idea. Mom didn't think about that this year. There's always room for improvement. Oh my child, I know You hurt and you can't let go It's not your fault and you don't deserve All the bad and the hurt I know you tried so hard Ooh, I know you've done your part It's not fair You did your time How much longer will you suffer in this life? But don't give up Just hold on tight It'll be alright All your life you've tried To be a good man inside Did everything that
that you thought you should. Guys, I have waited so long. So Dan and I have not had, uh, how long has it been? Like two years? It's been a really long time. <laughs> I think we went to Maine. No, we got Willa's lip tie revised. That's when it oh, stopped yeah. working. <laughs> That's when you plug your phone into the... <laughs> the thing and then it just stopped working. <laughs> it was four weeks old when we lost uh, the ability to play music in our vehicle. Going? We're gonna go to the jumping place. Yeah. yeah. It's so much fun. It is so much fun. You're it's right. Fun. You excited? Uh oh. What? I think a big kids go to. The big kids? No, the big kids aren't going there. It's just for the little kids. Daddy's syncing my phone. Alrighty, so we're at the mall. Will and I have to run some errands and I also have an appointment at the Apple store later on today uh, for my phone because my phone has been acting up basically ever since I got it and it's just time for me to figure out what's going on. I hope they give me a free phone because I really don't want to buy a new one right now. But I need to go into Sephora and I need to get myself some shampoo and conditioner and I will explain why in a second. Send me your letter when you're done. All right, so I was gonna get new shampoo and conditioner because um, I ran out of the samples that they gave me when I got my hair cut. And then on top of that, the shampoo that I've been using, the like milkshake one, it doesn't do a really good job of cleaning my hair, like actually cleansing it. So I think I'm gonna use that just as kind of like a leave-in mask after getting uh, my hair washed by, like, with like regular shampoo. I just went into Sephora and I didn't really see anything that I liked in there, so I'm gonna try Ulta, but I'm not necessarily looking for something that's super expensive. Um, I don't know, I have to figure out what shampoo I wanna use. Maybe I'm just gonna go, end up going with um, Pureology again. I used to use Pureology. morning folks how are you doing so a few days have passed I think yesterday we were filming so maybe one day <laughs> yeah not that much time it is Valentine's Day and we are hanging out as a family today and the first thing that we have on our docket is we're going breakfast date. on a breakfast date you guys are wondering what Dan and I are doing for Valentine's Day we decided to forego chocolates and flowers and presents and expensive dinner and all that jazz we just got a Nintendo Switch. So we, yeah, we took all that money and we bought a Switch. Yeah. So, we like gifts that just keep on giving. I made a heart. Two packages came from Tubby Todd. This one I received yesterday. I didn't get a chance to show you guys. So Tubby Todd just came out with toothpaste. Yay! It's fluoride free, which is awesome. Super awesome because that means it's safe for like younger kids to use which is exactly what we want This one's the juicy watermelon and they say that this one um, seems to be a, a fan favorite for like the younger kitties And then they have this one that's more like a traditional toothpaste. It's sweet mint And yeah, same thing So I smelled both of them and I actually tasted them and this one is really awesome But obviously I'm used to mint toothpaste. This is the one that we're gonna start using with Cooper and Willa Definitely, but yeah, look how much toothpaste you get. Seriously, a lot of toothpaste. I have a code for Tubby Todd. It's Lex Fitzgerald 15 and it gets you 15% off all of your orders, regardless of whether you're like a new customer or not. So guys, remember that code, Lex Fitzgerald 15. Um, if you guys ever forget it and you need it, just DM me on Instagram, or you can find it in my highlights on Instagram, and I'll try to put it below in the description of every video so that uh, you can always just head there and see all of our like codes. But I also have another package that just arrived for them today, and I'm really excited about this one. They had contacted me and asked me what size I was, so I have a feeling I know what it is, but I'm totally gonna put it on today if it's what I think it is. Hey guys, 
so I just had my ultrasound and um, if you guys are not familiar with like what's going on right now so I was having some chest pain and they ended up giving me a chest x-ray an EKG and then they sent me for an ultrasound for my breast because I had found like a breast lump and um, the radiology technician um, said that everything looks like pretty normal and that we're I should be fine and everything's good to go so we're just waiting on the radiologist to check up on it and to kind of just see um, just like go over everything and just kind of see and just like confirm that I'm okay but she said that I have like really um, dense breast tissue which I kind of have always suspected because whenever I would do like breast checks I would always be like I feel lumps <laughs> like, I'm not supposed to I don't think but I would. It makes me feel way better because I always suspected that that was something that I had. But yeah, I'm just sitting here and I'm not allowed to get dressed. I have my nifty robe on right now. <laughs> um, but she said she'll come back in in a little bit and she'll let me know if I'm good to go. Super crazy. So I straightened my hair yesterday morning. <laughs> Where are we going today? We're going to Target. So we are off in the car now. We are going to Target. Uh, we're gonna let Cooper and Willa pick out a Valentine's Day gift for one another, and then I'm gonna hit the dollar spot to try to see if they have any of those like little ceramic thingies, you know, and you can like go and paint ceramics. So I figured we would all, we'd get four of them and this afternoon we can all sit and just like paint ceramics together. I feel like that's a nice little Valentine's Day thing to do together. If I want to get flowers, I just buy myself flowers. If I want chocolate, I mean I eat too much chocolate to begin with. Like nobody wants like a box of chocolates. They're really not that great. I don't know anyone who's like, my go-to chocolate is a box of chocolates. Yeah. I mean, if they were, you probably would buy those chocolates all year round. Yeah. But you only eat like an eighth of the box and actually enjoy it. And I don't even like coconut. Yeah, exactly. Just, like muscling through them just to finish the box. Like who eats the the like some the truffle like the the jam ones? Yeah, like there's just some in there that you just like nobody likes. Speaking of now, what's your favorite chocolate in the chocolate box? Mine's the coconut cream. Mine's all the ones with nuts in them. Really? In description. Dan likes the nuts. <laughs> We're getting, I'm getting real and like, I was talking about. Don't. <laughs> guys, so funny. So I said something on my, in my Instagram stories. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, then you totally know what I'm talking about because it was hilarious and I got like a million DMs because of it. Everyone was like, that just made me laugh so hard. And. I walk in the house because I was sitting in the car when I when I said it. You didn't even make it into the house. I walked out to meet you. <laughs> Dan was like, did you just say what I think you said on Instagram? Like he was concerned for <laughs> for my follower count. <laughs> I was like, babe, they gotta know the real me. Sometimes I make I make raunchy jokes. I can't help it. It's just the way I am. It wasn't even like a raunchy joke, it was yeah, just a term just a that you never hear on YouTube channels. <laughs> Um, if you guys are trying to figure out what we're talking about, take the word jazz and just think of like Here we go. a word that could kind of sound like that. I don't even know where this tangent went. This is just tangenting. Oh, we're talking about chocolates. Yeah, so I don't really like feel the, the need to like own, to get like boxes of chocolates or any stuff like that. So. Um, I'm totally happy with the Nintendo Switch. We were playing Mario Kart last night. So much fun. Also, guys, I had to get a new phone yesterday at the mall. Um, this is my new case now. Hi. Cute. My phone is purple. I got the iPhone 11. Could have gotten the iPhone 11 Max QR, and it kind of makes sense for me to have that type of phone because um, of what, like, I'm just always taking photos and, like, for brands and all that kind of stuff. But... 
you just don't always need the biggest and the best of things. You just don't. So I was perfectly content just upgrading to this phone right here. I actually had an iPhone 6 before I got my iPhone 10. That just goes to show like how how reserved we are when it comes to purchasing certain things. Um, but yeah, yesterday was like definitely a mandatory necessity because my iPhone 10 was about to break and they were willing to let me trade it in for like a very high retail value and to like put towards this phone. So, um, yeah, that makes, hopefully that makes sense to you guys. But that's the new case I got. My phone's purple. Figured I'd show you guys. Guys, nothing like a good cry to start off your Valentine's Day. Just watch the saddest music video ever. Um, it's um, Brother by Codaline, I think is how you pronounce it. I'm so behind in like the music. But oh my goodness, I literally just like, Dan was like, it's gonna make you cry. So I started watching it and I was like. <laughs> what? Mommy. Mommy sad? My baby girl. Mommy, mommy you want mommy to be happy? Oh my goodness, I am the smartest little one and a half year old ever. You want mommy to be happy? Okay. Thank you, Bubba. Let's get out of the car and go to Target so Mommy can stop crying. Okay? Yeah, okay. Oh, should we, like, evacuate? <laughs> should I be alarmed? <laughs> the fire alarm's literally going off right no now. Yeah. Okay. All right. Close your eyes Get some rest I'm by your side Lay your head on my chest I know you've had Target and I want to show you the sweatshirt that I ended up going with so this is it this is what it looks like see it has the little V and I ended up going with the cream color I don't know I just the tie-dye was super cute um, and I see like a lot of people on Instagram buying that like style right now but it's just not me not my thing um, it's something that I would have purchased and I would have never reached for but I really like this cream color and I really like the idea of in the springtime just wearing like some leggings and some like flat sneakers maybe like my um, maybe like my leopard vans and then putting this on and then having my denim jacket over this sweatshirt I just think that'd be a really cute outfit definitely like my style I feel like it's bump friendly so if I eventually have a bump, I'll be able to wear it like through the spring. It's definitely one of those sweatshirts that are also kind of like summer sweatshirts where you can like put it on in like the morning or the evening. So yeah, I decided to get this one and best funny story, I scanned it in my Target 
app and instead of being $25 it was on sale for 14 something and then I scanned it at the register and it was on sale for 11 something and then I had a 20% off cartwheel online plus a 5% off because we have a target card so I ended up getting it for like nine bucks nine dollars originally 25 part of their new their new releases yep talk about a steal The sky is beautiful and so are you I wanna make it up to you, start something new Yeah, I've been thinking of the parts I play for you And how I'm drinking from the bottle as I do It's like a long dream You're on the So I can do a dance and make us both forget Only to start it up and play it out again It's like a going and taking care of us. We don't know exactly what they're doing out there. Oh, Dodo, she nest. Yeah. She's tall. What? Mommy says Dodo, she's tall. Dodo, see tar? Dodo's in the, oh yeah, Dodo's in his car seat? Oh, Dodo, she's oh, night He Oh, he's went night night in the car? Oh, I see. You want to see him? Yeah. You want to see him? But he's, well, we can't see him, love bug. He's in the car. See. Oh, gosh. Way to just throw throw yourself into my arms there. Oh, I don't want to see. You want to? Nanai. You want to see Dodo sleep in? My, my, my. Yeah? Oh, no. You're looking out the window. Say, Dodo, where are you? Dodo. Dodo, where are you? Can you say, I love you? I love you, Dodo. I love you, Dodo. Can you say love you, Mama? I love you, Mama. Oh, thank you. Bye, Mama. Oh, thank you. Bye, Dodo. Oh, Dodo, you love Dodo. What about Dada? Dada, she's nanai. Dada's going nanai. Can you say you're the best, Mommy? Best Daddy. Best Daddy. <laughs> best Dodo. Best Dodo. Best Willa. What about mommy? Willa, best Willa. Best Willa? Can you say you're the best mommy? Best. All oh, that. Best mommy! <laughs> best mommy! Monkey. Yeah, you know I'm gonna tickle you. Can you say best mommy? Best mommy. Thank you. That is blue, yes. Our recycling can is blue. Can you say one? Two. Yep. Eek, five, three. <laughs> you missed a few. Funny story, guys, about this little ham. So, I told Cooper, I was sitting on the couch, and I told Cooper 
Cooper, can you go get an apple for Willa? So Cooper and Willa go running over to the fridge and I hear them, they're in the fridge. Cooper comes running back, Willa's still over there. And he goes, mommy, there's no apples. We have to go to the store. I still hear Willa rummaging in the fridge. And I'm like, Cooper, can you go get Willa and take her away from the fridge? Like get her to get out of the fridge. And he goes, no mommy, she'll punch me. <laughs> about fell off the couch because he was so sincere and he was like so concerned <laughs> that he was gonna get punched and i i wanted to to say to him like no honey like he's not like she's not going to punch you but i honestly can't guarantee that she's not gonna start throwing punches odd you wanna watch odd bods she's a very intense little girl <laughs> she's, she's we're in trouble she's a doozy you want help? <laughs> Willa, can you help Dodo? Yeah. Okay. Help! 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 Push, push, push. Oh, it's stuck. Ugh. Okay, go, go. Push, push, push. You got it. Oh. Help! Okay. Okay, push, push, push. Good job, Willa. Hi guys, good morning. Oh, I came on here basically to end the video <laughs> because everyone got sick and it's just been not fun. Like I'm okay, Dan's actually okay, so that's technically a lie. Um, but Cooper, poor Cooper, he is actually really sick and Willow's definitely not feeling well, but Cooper definitely got like the brunt of it. You see like that? We're not feeling too good, right? Who's that? You wanna see outside? Yeah, mommy's looking out the window. Mommy. No, that's mommy's rambling redhead flower. Yeah. That's mama's. That is it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Today I'm officially in my fertile window, but tomorrow is the day that I start actually testing for ovulation. And then three days later is ovulation day, usually. So things are happening. The next video that you watch is probably going to be um, a TTC update, and like we'll start ovulation testing and all of that jazz. So that is it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, we love you. We'll see you in the next video. If you're new, hi, guys. Welcome to our channel. Very happy to have you here. Yeah? You want to see again? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness gracious. Can you say bye? Love you. Bye. Can you say love you? Bye. Oh, that's so nice of you. Say see you soon. See you soon. Oh, bye. 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 <laughs> Could fall down, it's gonna be okay. The sun could go out, we're gonna be okay. If all the blue skies fade.